In this episode, we debut Battle Vlogs. Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Scratch Snobs. I'm Akiko Love, and this is the Battle Vlogs edition. In the next series of episodes that Scratch Snobs is going to be releasing, you'll be either following my journey and Mike's journey in the upcoming battle season. I'm primarily looking to enter DMC-related battles and local battles that fit with my schedule. As far as my goals next year, I'm really hoping to do better in the regional heats, hopefully to win one, and to place at nationals. I someday want to be a DMC world champion, and so I'm really working hard towards that goal. I know I'm years from that, but uh, I'm having really fun trying. <laughs> or, you know, I'm really enjoying the process, actually. That's one of the big reasons why I am looking to do this vlog. I know, for one, I'm, I'm definitely a little self-conscious and uh, a little bit insecure. Not really. More self-conscious about the, the idea of this. Um, I'm a little shy about this whole idea of it. Um, but I know sharing uh, will just help me become a better DJ and it will help me learn a lot faster. Um, and also, I just want to give back to the art that's giving me so much. You know, without DJing, without scratching, without turntablism, my life would be so empty. So, um, yeah, you know, I just want to share my passion and love for this art and, uh, you know, hopefully, you know, it could bring the same kind of meaning and joy for you guys as well. Um, so why, you know, one of the reasons why I love battling so much is, wow, that's what really first inspired me to become a DJ. Um, I saw on video uh, X-Men versus IS ISP and the ITF battle 20 years ago. Um, it's 20th anniversary, right? So I saw the, the video in 98 or so. And I was just totally blown away what I saw. I mean, I was kind of familiar with what DJing was and scratching, but when I saw Qbert, Mixmaster Mike, Shortcut, and Rock Raider, and, and, and Rob Swift, and <laughs> just do their thing on the turntables, I was just like jaw dropped, eyes glued, and I was like, I want to do that. And uh, yeah, that's when I first got the the, the inspiration and buck to battle and uh, I, I saved my my pennies uh, throughout the summer of 90 I, I had a job as a waiter and uh, I saved enough money at the end of the summer and I bought my first turntables and a mixer and uh, yeah it was a pair of Technics and an 05 um, Pro I remember when I first bought the turntables I was like what am I doing it's like I've never spent so much money on anything in my life before and I had two records. My first two records I ever bought were battle records. Um, Bionic Booger Breaks and 100 Mile Sliding Turkey, wait, Turkey Sliding Back Cuts? <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> the Dirt Style record. <laughs> um, and yeah, I remember I, I, I was playing one of the tracks and I was trying to scratch and my first time I was like, oh my god, what did I do? It was kind of buyer's remorse and the next morning I, was, I had kind of the, the same feeling. I'm like, what did I do? But then just so excited and I was glued to scratching. Uh, I battled um, about two years, two and a half years. And uh, I would say, um, I got I got discouraged <laughs> um, um, because I guess I felt like I hit a plateau and I wasn't really improving and I got just got busy with school and the mobile game was doing um, pretty good good for me and so I kind of stuck in that route and I, I I remember when I first started battling I wanted to do a DMC and, and that never happened and. Let's uh, let's say what what is it four years ago? So um, I didn't battle for I think over ten or twelve years. It was just like a bat, big huge gap. I battled two years, didn't battle for like ten twelve years, and then I decided to battle again. And I think my first battle was a a DMC. Yeah, this was a, a New York regional DMC in two thousand. Uh, skip. I'm not going to get the, the dates right. When was this? This is four years ago, right? Um, so 2012. I think that's right. 
2013. 2013, uh, New York DMC. I think that was my first DMC regional. And wow, what experience. That was, that was really fun. Um, and then the year following, um, I did the LA DMC as well. And then I did Vegas DMC. So I think I did three DMCs. Um, and uh, that was three, four years ago. So three years ago, and this, I'm coming, this coming year is my fourth year battling in DMCs. Uh, so my third year, I did pretty well last year. Um, I placed second in the Bay Area. I placed third in LA DMC. And so this, oh my God, this means so much to me. Um, I, I, I just felt, um, I wasn't sure if, if I could ever reach this, this level. <laughs> um, so for me to achieve this, I, it just very uh, motivating for me to keep on going and that I could achieve my goals. And, and um, yeah, it's, I can't wait to be a champ one day. I really want that to happen. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I'm going to be working really hard towards that, and um, I'm looking forward to hearing your thoughts um, and to growing with you guys. Um, it's going to be really fun. I'm really interested in what Mike C is going to do. Um, I don't know how long this first episode was like, if I was totally blabbing and stuff. So I just wanted to give a little quick history about myself um, and why I'm doing all this. So, yeah. This is me, Akiko Love. Uh, thank you for watching. Tune in, Scratch Snob Battle Vlogs Edition. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe below on our YouTube channel. And I will see you guys soon. Peace and love, guys.